Unbox the wooden crate. Please keep the wooden crate. Do not discard it. Assemble the printer stand. Place the base tray inside the stand and secure the fixing bars in place. Place the purifier on the base tray. Secure with screws. Detach the printer mounting brackets. Use a forklift to position the printer's main body on the base frame. Install the auto film take up system. Plug in a take up system. Using a pipe to connect the purifier and oven. Place a bucket inside the stand and insert one end of the oil tubes into the bucket. Install the ink supply system. Connect the copper wires together as labeled. Connect the ink filter to the ink bottle accordingly. Connect W2 to the reflux tube. Install the covers for ink supply system. Add ink as indicated on the label. Load the film roll and make sure print side up. Lift the pinch rollers manually. Pass the film through the pinch roller. Lower the pinch roller manually. Secure two sides of the film with media clips. Plug in the main power cable. Turn on the main switch. Plug in the printer cable and turn on the printer. Press left button to move the cartridge slightly outward. Unscrew the housing of the cartridge. Detach the ink damper holders. Remove the protective tape. Connect the ribbon cables to the print head as labeled. Install the print head on the carriage. Take out the ink dampers. 
Then install the ink damper holder. Insert the ink dampers in turn. Place the securing component into the slot. Secure it with a screw. Install the second print head in the same way. Use the syringe to draw ink through the ink damper until the damper is full of ink. Install the housing. Connect printer and computer with network cable. Plug in the dongle. Install the OtterPro RIP software. Secure the printed film on the core with tape. Then, turn off suction system. 